Hello, this is Pastor Nick Hood. I'm at the Alum Creek, uh, which is a little waterway that uh, flows through Columbus, Ohio. And uh, we're down here for Memorial Day with Denise's mother. And uh, I just wanted to show this to you, how peaceful it is. We're on a uh, bridge uh, that's part of the uh, Recreation Department of Columbus, Ohio. Uh, and I just want you to know that uh, I like this place because it's peaceful. I like this place because I can hear the birds. I like this place because the water in its own way is just flowing uh, behind me, to my left, to my right. And I like it that I can share this little bit of inner peace with you. And I tell you, Jesus Christ has taught us um, that my peace I leave with thee, my peace I give unto thee, not as the world gives, give I, uh, saith the Lord. And what Jesus is saying is, what is the peace of the world? The peace of the world is, you got to have a lot of money. What's the peace of the world? You got to have the newest, the best, the greatest car. What's the peace of the world? The peace of the world uh, is often uh, juxtaposed in the context of somebody else. Uh, can I keep up with the Jones? Uh, am I living as well as the Jones? And if I'm not living as well as the Jones, if my house is not as big as the Jones, if my car is not as new as the Jones, uh, if my stock portfolio is not as good as somebody else, can I still enjoy life? Denise and I and her mother just left. We came down to Columbus for Memorial Day. We just left uh, Denise's cousins, Walter, and uh, Stephen. We've been sitting on a porch for the last hour, uh, drinking cold drinks, uh, you know, gliding on the gliding rocking chair and chairs and talking about old times, people who've gone on uh, to glory, people who all meant a lot to us and now they're gone. But we're still here, we're still standing, we're still sitting uh, in those uh, glide chairs on an extended front porch of an old house in an old neighborhood, but we're having fun. And I tell you, this to me is what Jesus is talking about when he says, my peace uh, I leave unto thee, my peace I give unto thee, not as the world gives, give I, saith the Lord. What Jesus is really saying is, uh, I can give you something better uh, than this life. And uh, I can give you eternal life, but not only do I give you eternal life, but I can show you how to live in this life, a very good life, a life that is bigger than steak and caviar. I can give you a life that's bigger than the finest champagne. I can show you peace, which is more peaceful than the richest person's house. Uh, all you need to do is give your life unto me. And so I invite you this day, uh, to make a place in your heart for Jesus Christ, uh, not just to prepare you for the life to come, but make a place for Jesus in your life right now. Uh, because why not enjoy the best life possible? You may be 60, 70, 80, 90, 100 years of age, but Jesus can show you how to live a better life. You can have all the money in the world, you can have no money in the world, but if the Lord is in your life, you will have peace. And so that's the word that I'm giving you today. Strive for that best life. Strive for the peaceful life. Strive for the joyful life. And understand that Jesus Christ will help you to get there. I want you to, to invite you to pray with me right now. Gracious Master, our God, I pray that for every person within the sound of my voice that you will show us the pathway to inner peace. Show us the pathway to inner joy. Show us the pathway, O oh Lord God, to be happy, regardless of who's alive or who's dead. Show us, O oh Lord God, how to make the most out of this life every day of life, so that when the last day comes, that you can take us gently to glory, to that kingdom which has no end. But until that day, O oh Lord God, give us places like this, places where we can come, where we can relax, where we can refresh ourselves, to be renewed in thy spirit and to understand that you are God and God Almighty. In the name of Jesus, this is Pastor Nick Hood. 
I'm praying for you. God bless, God keep you. And until we meet again, I want you to know I am praying for you. Now, Denise, don't turn it off yet. Uh, show everybody again, what does Alum Creek look like? I've got my trusty camera assistant today and Denise. Denise grew up here. Lord knows what she was doing at Alum Creek before she met me. But this is her place. Oh, she's not breaking a smile on that. But uh, this is where Denise used to play. And I say, hey, hey, hey. Oh, look at the, on that side. Yeah. All right, Denise, I guess we can wind this down. But thank you again so much for helping me this day. Thank you for praying with me this day.